So one thing that I used to get asked all the time when I was working for a reseller, Autodesk reseller, was I just added a, a attribute to my block, um, but it's not showing up what's going on. Now there's actually an easy fix for, for that, but let's just take a look at um, the scenario here. So I've got these, these three toilets inserted in here, and what I wanna do is I wanna add an attribute to it. So let's just take one of them, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit that block in place. Now whether I'm using the block editor or the reference edit tool is all the same. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to define a new attribute. So I'm going to define a new attribute here for the manufacturer. And the prompt's going to be manufacturer. And the default here can be American Standard. Okay, so we'll make sure it's big enough that we can see it. And what we'll do is we'll just drop this into my block. So I've added the, the attribute for that. I'm happy with the position, location, and everything. So let's save, save our changes here. So we'll click OK. And what I can see is that that attribute is not appearing anywhere in the blocks. Same thing if I double click on it, the edit attribute dialog box is not coming up. Now to kind of compound it a little bit, I'm going to go into my inserts here and I'm going to drop in another toilet here. And what I can see is that when I drop that in, notice that it's bringing in that attribute. So now I have four instances of the same block definition. One has um, that attribute, the other three don't. So what can I do? Well, the, the thing that you want to do or the command that you want to run is what's called synchronize attributes. Um, so the command, if you want to type it out, is att sync. Um, it's also in, in the ribbon, so you can go in there and you can actually update your references with it. Um, right at the moment, I forget where it is. Synchronize is under block definition, so I can go through there and actually synchronize it. Now the way it works here is, is you can come in here and you can actually pick by name and then and then you know type in the name of the block and go select. Now it might kind of give you the impression that um, you can just pick individual instances, but really here it doesn't matter which one I select. What it's going to do is it's going to force an update and notice how that attribute's now been pushed into all those blocks. So now if I double click on this block and come in here and say, well this was actually Penguin. And I'll click OK, and we can see that attributes updated. So very easy fix, ATT sync or synchronize attributes. Um, and the same thing happens if you go and delete the attribute, you can run that sync to force those blocks to update.